Hi there YouTube world, this is my first video and I'm really excited. I have been on YouTube for many years since like 2008 and I just was watching the videos and I was mostly using it to do like make playlists and listen to music but lately I've been really inspired by all the great YouTubers and I wanted to make a video of my own so I was I'm not entirely sure what I want my channel to be like um or if you look at any views at all but what I wanted to do is uh do a bit of a uh, makeup or product review just like some uh other YouTubers do and so I'm just gonna start out with some of the stuff that um, I've been using recently and if you're wondering what I'm wearing this is um, a scrub top because I am a student nurse and I have had a long day um, but I really wanted to make a YouTube video because it's um, something I've been thinking about for a really long time. So anyways, uh, I'll just get started and um, talk about some of the things that I've been using. So um, one of the most important things for me is having makeup that stays on all day long because if you're doing shifts in a hospital, you're definitely running around a lot and it you just you get kind of sweaty and the makeup sometimes if it's not really like if it doesn't stay put then that can be a problem so anyways I was trying um, Lanicombe's new 24 hour um, wear foundation and it looks like that and that is what I have on right now and I actually just ran out of it and just I just finished it um, and it also has a moisturizer in it and a sunscreen at SPF 15 so that's really good if you live somewhere that's sunny unfortunately it's snowy here so it doesn't matter but um, yeah I found that it was really good and it's for all skin types I have a little bit of um, a combination skin I guess so I have a bit of oil and then um, some dryness so I really enjoyed that and it does stay on really long but I wanted to try something else after that and so right now I just bought this uh, Chanel and it is um, it was actually on sale so that's why I bought it and so I'm excited to try that and I have only used it once so far but um, it goes on really really smooth and it smells amazing so once I wear that for a little bit longer I'll let you know how it goes um, I would definitely recommend the Lanicombe one for anyone who's gonna be like working in a hospital or working um, any long type of day because it's going to be really good for you and it's going to stay on your skin for a really long time and it has really good coverage too if that's something that you're worried about. I know that I have a couple spots so I like to try and cover those up. Another thing that helps me um, for the oily parts of my skin is something I've been using for a while and it is um, basically a precision refining solution kind of and it looks like this and it's by Chanel also. Um, and it looks a little bit green and it goes on clear, but it just reduces the amount of oil that will like show through your makeup and I would definitely recommend that for um, anyone with really oily skin who's going to be working a long day. So that's another thing and um, another thing that's just not specific to people who are going to be like working in the hospital or any kind of long day that's going to make you work hard but just things for winter. As you can see I'm wearing bright red lipstick. I love winter colors and one that I really like is this one right here. Um, you can see it's kind of it's kind of like a plum but not entirely. It's a little bit burgundy and it's actually um, a company that makes all natural products. It's called Aveda. Um, so you can see the name right there. And uh, this shade is called Anato, A-N-N-A-T-T-O 35. And it's a little bit sticky to put on. Like, it really sticks to your lips. But once you have it on, it's going to, it just dyes your lips and it stays on all day long. So even after you drink or eat or anything like that, if you don't have time to reapply in the day, it's really, really good. And it's a really pretty color for winter and then another winter thing that I have really been enjoying is the Lanicombe Paris um, eyeliner in liquid and I have a color called aubergine I don't know if it's French or something but I have it on my eyes right now and you can't tell with like the bright light that I have but it's actually um, kind of a dark purple so I really like to wear that for the winter and I don't know if you can see um, if I open it but it's not quite black 
and I just find that really really nice for the winter time um, another thing that I wanted to talk about is just the blush that I've been using so I have it on my face right now but it's kind of worn off this is um, the two a duo um, blush so it's got I don't know if you can see but it's got the lighter color and the darker color and it mixes together on your skin when you um, put it on and it's in the Chanel uh, it's a duo and it's called Tweed Coral and I really like it for the winter it gives you that really like flush look without having bright bright red cheeks you don't really want that but just um, I like to shy away from the, bl the bronzer in the winter time because it looks a little unnatural if you're really really having a big tan when there's a bunch of snow outside so I really like that for now and the last thing that I want to talk about is the perfume that I'm using um, Dot by Marc Jacobs and it is um, it's sort of citrusy and flower not flowery citrusy or fruity kind of and they have another one called Daisy and you're like what is this what is it it looks like a ladybug and um, yeah it just it smells really fresh and it's it's really light so it's not too overpowering so you can wear it around people who are a little bit more sensitive to smells and things like that and that is the last thing that I have that I wanted to talk about and share with you guys so if you are watching thank you for watching and I hope you enjoyed my first video I will hopefully make another video soon and hopefully you guys enjoyed this one bye YouTube